it's your favorite YouTube dealer. I appreciate you guys for stopping in. We got some new Glorb. I'm excited to dive into this. It's called Mob Ties. I was actually just recording my reaction to the Drake diss and then the Rick Ross response. And when I refresh my YouTube, I just happened to see this pop up. So I thought, you know what? Perfect timing. Let's dive in. And let's see what this is all about because I'm, I'm all hyped up off the diss track stuff. So I'm ready. I'm ready for some shit. And I feel like Glorb always delivers. So uh, let's get into it. Let's see what he's cooking with. This is a puff production. They thought they had us in the first half, huh? <laughs> no. I am back. That boy gonna leave. That boy gonna die. Know that I'm him because there's only one out. It's a rolling in a deep. I like that. We really turn in that side. Really, we really live in that life. Really, it's really giving more time. Really, it's really giving that. She said my dick fat like queso. Yo, my man said, yo, she said my dick fat like queso. I'm not super familiar with queso, but I know that he's a streamer because I've watched a couple of podcasts with like Jinxie and, and Critical and uh, and who else was it? He, he just did a podcast with Aiden Ross. I listened to those while I was on this long drive to Ohio to go make music myself. And I want to say that the name Queso came up. So I'm familiar with the name. I just don't know much about him. But my man definitely just caught a shot. And then he said I'm Jinxie with the Siege. So Jinx, yeah, Jinxie's, a, 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 I, I like him. I like him. I don't watch a lot of like streams and stuff like that. But I watch other content that people make like podcasts. And and I, I, I like him. He seems like a good kid. Really giving mom time. Really, it's really giving that. She said my dick fat like Queso. Yeah, I'm Jinxie with the Siege, no rainbow. Siege up on crap. Yo, my man saying some madness in this. Speaking of that Jinxie bar, though, I feel like now I want to play some Rainbow Six Siege. I ain't even going to lie to you. I ain't played that shit in a minute. If you guys play, let me know down below in the comments. I'm curious. Am I dick fat like queso? So? Yeah, I'm Jinxie with the Siege, no rainbow. Siege, rolling up on crabs with the six. Had him staring at the chick, turn that boy to turn angle. Underwater, <laughs> under pressure, under pain. Up and daughters in my quarters, eating Dagnan's mayonnaise. That's and wild. I'm getting bloody that I'm fucking under face. Now I'm feeling like a vampire. Fuck, I'm in the rain. My man says, I'm going to touch him like a pedo. Yo, that's a wild bar. Yo, my man out here wildin'. Casino, Jake ain't got to strip his baby, bring a couple casinos. Where the opposition, I'm going to touch him like a pedo. Fuck up, Brian, pick him, lick a loading up a double gun. Oh, is Brian? Who, I see. I don't know who that is. Brian, something. I, I just know there was a lot of stuff coming out about the whole Nickelodeon shit and stuff like that, and some real odd individuals will say that that was involved in it with a lot of these kids and stuff back in the day, which is some madness. I've considered making a video about it, but I just I just haven't had the time to look into it. That's crazy. I feel like it's got to be because then the whole touch him like a pedo comes before it, and then Nickelodeon. It, it 100 percent all kind of mixed in. Like a pedo, fuck up, Brian, pick him, Nickelodeon up a double gun. That boy gonna die, know that I'm him, cause there's only one out, it's some rolling in a deep. That's a dope bar. I like that part too. A lot of the wordplay in this is actually really, really dope. I like this. My man cooked with the wordplay. Introduce myself, I'll be the puff hard. Yeah. Size, I size, I'm the rip because I puff hard. Yeah. Said, fuck you, Gene, that boy, a bitch, he couldn't fuck hard. Yeah. I mean, it literally, bitch, I'm finna blow up. So fuck these pussies, I'm a ride, this ain't no driving school. Is this an actual character in a cartoon? Or is this something that's completely made up? Those thighs is ridiculous. Like, what in the... 
<laughs> I don't know what this is. This shit is madness, though. Time to introduce myself. I'll be the plus one. Yeah. Fucking size I in the ring because I puff hard. I said, fuck you, Gene, that boy, a bitch. He couldn't fuck hard. I mean, it literally, bitch. I'm finna blow up. So fuck these pussies. I'm a ride. This ain't no driver school. I shot his feet and had him dancing like my diamonds do. Fucking double D. My chest on overload. Told him, grab the keys. I'm gonna show him how I motorboat. Yo, that was fire. Glorb, yo, I've, I've said this before in the other reactions. Like, Glorb is really talented. Like, this dude is legit at making music. And and again, I I, I don't I don't know if he makes his own music. I want to say some someone responded to me before, and I can't remember what you guys said. If he does make his own music, but it's like he doesn't like connect it with this this channel and the characters that he raps as and stuff like that. Or if he's considering making his own music but hasn't yet, and this is kind of what he does right now. I don't I don't remember what somebody told me, but this man's got talent. He could he could do some shit with music like he's got a good good understanding of pretty much everything to do technically with music. The hooks are always really dope. The wordplay is fire. The writing is on point like he's definitely legit. But this shit is funny like it's it's crazy and he does numbers man. 652,000 subscribers. These things usually get millions and millions of views and I can see why. Genius move. Even if he doesn't make music outside of doing this, like it's it is what it is. Like this, this was a genius move on his part because it, it it's not always easy to get attention just as someone who makes music. Like there's so many people out there doing it, but to do something like this, especially when he possibly came along when it wasn't something that was happened nearly as much and and did it at this level, that shit hits. My man's cooking. So comment below. Let me know what you thought about this. This this one might have been one of my favorite ones. I just I really like this one. The hook was fire. Like the whole deal. Queso getting shots. Uh, shout out to Jinxie. Like, I, I, I like that he ties in different people that are, you know, kind of popping, so to speak, on, on different platforms and stuff like that as far as, like, in the content creation space. I think that that's cool. It just makes me wonder, again, if, if, if nobody knows exactly who Glorb is, if it's just some dude who does this kind of shit, it makes you wonder who, who he might be. Like, he obviously watches and pays attention to a lot of the shit. May even be somebody that's amongst the, you know, amongst the group, so to speak. But... Comment below. Let me know what you guys think. I appreciate you. I don't know. Like, again, and then some of the shit I'm saying, I might be completely wrong because again, I, I don't, I don't follow a lot of different people. I just, I do my reactions. I focus on my content. I do my own live streams and stuff like that. So I don't really like pay much attention and I try to read through the comments. So some of you guys may have explained more to me who Glorb is and maybe I missed it. So I do apologize, but take it easy. Stay safe. I'll catch you in the next one, homies. They said that I couldn't do what I'm doing. Like, what were you thinking? Were you thinking? They tried to tell me that I wasn't made for this shit. I'm like, what were you thinking? I don't know what he was thinking. Acting like I still got something to prove. Like, what were you thinking? What were you thinking? I've been improving. Well, you ain't been moving, my nigga. Like, what were you thinking? What were you thinking? Like.